Hello everyone, I hope you're enjoying this game. I know I am. Anyway, I thought I'd share. So you know this NPC, one of the first that you meet. Her name is Eureka, I believe. And uh, she's cute. She's like a really, really cute. And I know that you can increase your affinity with some of the NPCs here. So I thought I have this pendant in my inventory, which I got it pretty early, I think just by looting some of the chests. Uh, I'm not sure exactly now which chest I got it from, uh, but I got it really early on the game. I had it there and I thought I'll give it to her and see what happens. And it turns out that this pendant, the heartfelt pendant, it takes her affinity all the way to the max. I gave it to her and she was like, that's it. And then I got the pop-up from Steam, the challenge of increasing an NPC's affinity to the max. And here's the cool thing that the developers kind of added to this. So now, every time I see her, you can see that her cheeks just turn red. I thought it's a really cool detail that they added. That's one of the things I love about this game, all the attention to details. And this is not the only thing that you get out of increasing the affinity. So now, every once in a while, she would drop gifts at my house in Vermont. And I'll make another video about how to get this house, but it's pretty straightforward. Anyway, just coming back to this, as you can see, sometimes she would stop by, uh, leave a note and a gift, and you can read the note. And in this case, she left a fairy stone which is very useful. So yeah, if you have a chance to increase your affinity with some of these NPCs, do it because they do give you things. I have another NPC, I think a little girl that you meet at the very beginning of the game as well. She will ask you uh, for some, I think some, for some consumables or something like that. I forgot about it, her name is Flora. So I just gave her some flowers and, and now she also will occasionally drop a gift outside my door. She would just, with a message, and, uh, and I didn't drop, in this case, was a food robberant. I think that's what she wanted originally at the beginning too, like a some, something, something robberant. Anyway, I thought I'd share, if you have the opportunity to give flowers or gift to an NPC, do it and I see what other gifts they give back to you. All right, so that's it for the video. Just a really quick one. I hope you all have fun, enjoy the game. I love you all and I'll see you all in the next video.